Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. Let's talk about too much information right now. Not the kind of information we're getting from media. We're talking about information coming from you. It comes to my attention, many of you are being hacked on your internet devices right now. There's a lot of things going around about a lot of people that hasn't been authorized. A lot of private information about you that no one knows about and they're finding out about it on the internet. Our internet is a wonderful tool. I use it in DGTV. I use it in my private practice. I use it to communicate these tune-ups across the country and around the world. However, a lot of times we're really unaware of some of the things that are going on within our own Facebook accounts, our Google accounts, and I'm going to caution each one of you to understand there's also a high alert right now on routers. It's been discovered that your router, especially if it's wireless, can be easily hacked by just about anybody who can find it on their computer. There's free software out there on the internet right now that can hack these routers even if they have web protection service built into them. It's found now that that web protection service doesn't even work. Even if it's turned off, it's still on. So be cautious about that because many of you, and I've had several clients, that have been hacked with private information about their bank accounts, their identity, is all over the internet and they did not authorize it. So we got to be careful. Also, when we're talking about our own private business, many times we really don't know who's just sitting behind us at Starbucks or a coffee shop listening and writing down information about us. I'm sorry to say this and I'm kind of sad about it. We're in a different kind of a time now, a high alert time, a lot of paranoia, a lot of fear going on. I'm going to ask you to really, really kind of batten down your own hatches. Take a little surveillance trip around your own stuff and make sure you're well protected. The damages can be insurmountable. It's happened to me. I've had my identity stolen. I've had much written about me on the internet that's untrue. And I've also had a lot of things happen to me that I was completely unaware of from information that was out there about me that was unauthorized. And it was got through the routers, it was got through the internet, and it was got through hacking my own personal systems. I know hundreds of people this very same thing has happened to. It takes a lot of time to unravel this. Also, when you're talking about your personal information, whether it's your relationship, it's your job, be really careful on who you're saying it to. Sometimes friends are not friends. Sometimes friends turn on friends at the moment of a heated argument and they can take that information and use it against you. So today, be aware of your own private stuff and keep it private. Be very, very diligent and do not trust all this electronic equipment because it's all talking to each other now and we really never know what's going on around us, even with our own cell phones. And many of you are unaware that even if you turn your cell phone off and take the battery out of it, it's still alive because it has a built-in chip inside of it that has power that keeps it active all the time. So take care of yourself, pay attention. There's a lot going on out there and there's a lot to really mess things up for you that you're really not asking for. Just be careful who you talk to. Be careful how you spread your personal information around. Even if you're unhappy with your spouse or a boyfriend or a girlfriend, be careful what you say and keep it personal. Our own personal business is supposed to be personal. And the moment you start sharing it, whether it's on Facebook or even talking to a friend sometimes, those phones are alive, those cameras are alive. We just never know where it's going to go from there. So until I talk to you tomorrow, I'm asking you to have a very productive week. Pay attention. You might Google routers and router hacking right now and find out how to get yours protected. I would encourage everyone to do that. Also, I'm going to turn you to an internet program called This Week in Tech with Leo Laporte. Leo Laporte is in Northern California, here fairly close to me. He's got a lot of information on this and he's sharing it online right now. So that's Twit TV or Twit T-W-I-T dot TV. You might go check it out there. They have more information on this than just about anyone. 
So until tomorrow, this is Dr. Gary wishing you a great day. Bye-bye.